Hi family. So I'm going to make this video here primarily for the folks who uh, are still on Facebook. Um, I don't want to say I, I can't believe people are still on Facebook because I, I see people <clears throat> people are still watching television so anything's all silliness is on the table. Um, anyway, I, I'm sorry. Just Oh yeah, these social media platforms writ large, I don't really resonate with them. But anyway, so today I was looking up some bus tickets for a friend and online, uh, and I, I, um, I was redirected to a website on Facebook. Now, I haven't been on Facebook for years because, well, because it's, it's it's fascist book, but, um, no, well, because I just don't have time to keep up with social media like that, you know, and, and working really hard, um, living off grid and doing reforestation projects and, um, creating a community garden of organic food so that we may feed our children in these times of hyperinflation that no one wanted to hear anything about when I got here four years ago, but I think they're <laughs> taking, I, yes, I believe, yes, I think everybody everywhere can feel the effects of hyperinflation now. It's okay to talk about it, <laughs> but it's, um, you know, let that be a sign to remember what's important. <clears throat> Oh, uh, anyway, so, um, that's what I did. I took my life savings and I built this school. Well, it was my home, but it was also modeled in such a way as I wanted it to be the place of the gathering for the, for the people to come and see functioning prototypes. <clears throat> of the esoteric technologies, the real technology, not the artificial one. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Just, uh, oh. Mm. Love, 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 right? Just love. <laughs> oh. AI. Mm -mm -mm. So, um, artificial intelligence, <laughs> a lot of people downloaded some viruses in their corona or something, something going on. <laughs> Oops, can't talk about that either, that's one of my erased videos. Well, anyhow, so I, I built this beautiful house slash school slash garden and community center and permaculture and, and, um, 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 after some hit ma major, major, major hidden defects and some other things, and I talked about this, I think, in part one of another series, so I won't go into big, huge, long details, but suffice to say that Maria Deschamps, she's the wife of George, and I can't remember his last name, but, uh, Salvador took him around the, um, in the Sundance a few years ago. I can't remember which year. Maybe it was more than one year. Hey, hey, it's just those two. You guys know who I'm talking about. <laughs> um, they want me dead. <laughs> and if I'm out of the way, then they can just move right in and lay claim to my house. Because look, they have papers. <laughs> Oh, now, if you want to see more about those papers, you can look at part four of the series I posted the other day. But I'm just posting stuff um, to a public forum so that I can reach my audience, my subscribers, and any other people that I might share this hyperlink with. So, you know, que sera, sera, whatever will be, will be. I know my mission 
And my sole contract here is to create a safe and secure place for the children of Mother Earth to learn and grow and dream and live to their highest potential. And <laughs> Hello! <laughs> if it's not the dogs, there's always somebody that's like, Hello! <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Silly. He wants to be in the camera. Hello! It's part of the tree. He's green and cool. So beautiful, huh? Anyhow, um, so George and Maria have, uh, they, 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 they have their, they have their, they have their form and then they have their substance, right? There's the form and the substance, right? And everything's in divine order, I know. I'm not saying I know anything. But I know I have been stalked by blacked out window cars. I know I have been sabotaged on multiple levels when I try to get help or file a report of a crime or... And, um... You know, that's fine, they can take me out, but I'm going to say, can y'all just wait, because there's like a Mexican national living in my house, and if, um, if George and Maria can't wait for me to die to come and take my house, if they're not okay with my having offered that, that to them, which I did verbally and in writing, with their agent, Polo Lopez, as a witness. I was like, damn, that's a pretty generous thing of you to, to, for you to offer. To pay us for this land that, wink, wink, we don't own. <laughs> and has, oh my god, just a total nightmare waiting for you. It's going to steal every penny of your life savings and more. And more. <laughs> like, way more. <laughs> so many loans I had to take out because of the hidden defects. Anyway, it's all good in divine order, um, but there's some, there's a family in the house now with some, two small children, age one and four, and they love the house, they love the garden, they love the butterflies, they love the magic, they, it's their, it's their sacred dreams that I want to have projected into my, my 369 technology inside the house the sacred dream of the little child who's come here to lead the way. Mm -hmm. And I, I just don't, you know, I know. Okay, sada, sada. What will be, what will be. Thy will, great spirit. <laughs> For sure, thy will, great spirit, not my will. But look, while I'm in the physical world, <laughs> at least while I'm still here, you know, I do have some basic requirements, if that's okay with you. Money to pay the, the bills and eat and a house. So, you know, this kind of was the idea I had after working my entire life. For 25 years, I held the equivalent of one and a half to two, two and a half full-time jobs. And I made a lot of sacrifices. I did not get married. I didn't have kids. I didn't, like, I don't know. I didn't, I, I saved my money and I invested wisely. And uh, I thought, you know, it would be cool to kind of come and build something with that and leave a beautiful legacy behind and fulfill a dream. Or, you know, rather make a physical manifestation of a dream I had <clears throat> many years ago in, in Ecuador. Mm. Yeah, it's, it's getting real, family. I, I don't ask you for your help to save my life. Certainly, I am not afraid at all. In fact, rather, it's an honor.
to die at the hands of one's enemy. Hmm. The trinity of three just flew overhead. I don't know if you saw them. Hmm. So that's it, family. I just want to, um, I'm not trying to cause nobody no alarm. I don't want nobody to get worried about me. I don't know why, but oh, pray for my life and my safety. And oh, and no, 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 no. Just, you know, my dream. You know, my dream. Las Amias in Tiempo. And, um, <laughs> if it resonates with you, I ask you that you lift up my dreams. <laughs> Here he comes. Oops, everywhere now. <laughs> hmm. Yes. So they may take flight. And, uh, To my family in Ecuador, I also want to say thank you for everything. With eternal gratitude. Ooh. I should try to speak at least over the motorcycle. And the birds are like, no, 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 cut, cut, retake. The motorcycle's gonna drown you out. <laughs> You take uh, um, to my family in Ecuador. Oh, eternal gratitude and love, and what that was. There goes even this lazy girl. Even that lazy girl got up to go see who it was and now look she can't be bothered. I guess I gotta go over there and see. It could be a, a falling palm frond or they could be trying to chase the iguana or something. I don't know. Well it's the purse dogs. Oh boy. It's those passive aggressive Creatures. I might do another video about that too. But anyway, as for my family in Ecuador, I just want you to know because I only got on Facebook accidentally today. I haven't been able to log on for mm, a while. And Yeah, I, uh, I'm grateful for your support in the spiritual world. I love you so much. Those are Florcito kisses. You guys see who is Florcito? She's got her own playlist on my channel. Excuse me now, I got to go check on an iguana. Hmm. Ciao for now.